Christmas! Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Well, boys and girls, parents, it's going to be a little different year for Christmas. The Elfs and I have been very busy making all of the gifts for you. But for the tree lighting, we're going to have a virtual lighting. We're going to have the Inland Choir, and Jack Minashi is going to say a few words. So I want you all to be safe. Have a Merry Christmas. Hello West Seattle, it is with great joy that we join you tonight for the Junction's virtual tree lighting celebration. While things look a bit differently this year, we are so fortunate to be able to join with our community and really celebrate the season. My name is Megan McCormick and I am the director of the Endeline Children's Choir, which brings music education to singers from right here in West Seattle. Our fabulous young singers have been working hard to bring holiday cheer right to your homes. Join me in welcoming our encore and advanced ensemble singers to the stage as they perform Light Up the Tree. brought to you by our Encore and Advanced Ensemble Singers. Our Encore Singers are in grades 3rd through 5th and our Advanced Ensemble consists of 6th all the way to 12th grade. Next up, Advanced Ensemble is going to sing Stars I Shall Find by Victor Johnson. <laughs>
move on to the next piece in our program, I want to give you an opportunity to sing. So if you don't mind finding a place you can stand comfortably, checking your posture, we are going to sing Jingle Bells together a cappella. And when we get to the last song in our program, we want you to join with us in Jingle Bells. So we start on this note on the word dashing. One, two, try it, go. Dashing through the snow in a one horse open sleigh. O'er the fields we go, laughing all the way. Bells on bobtails ring, making spirits bright. What fun it is to laugh and sing a sleighing song tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Perfect! Your posture was great. You sounded fantastic. When it is time at the very end, I will invite you to sing with us. But for now, let's go ahead and listen to Encore and Advanced sing Sisi Nimoya.
All right, everyone, thank you so much for coming to our virtual performance today and celebrating the season with the West Seattle Junction. We want to say a huge thank you for the Junction for allowing us to be a part of this community event and invite any young singers out there that might be interested in learning more about music and their voices to check out endlinechoir.org because our winter registration opens very soon. Before we start our last song, we have one dance move that we want to make sure we teach everyone so that you can join us with your jingle bells. So what we do is we're standing in place and all it is is a little march in place and a smile on your face. So when you see our singers starting to do this, join along and as soon as you hear jingle bells, we would love to hear your voice joining ours. Happy holidays from all of us at Endline and enjoy. I'm King County Council Member Jill McDermott, really excited to join you for the tree lighting this evening. It's no accident that in the middle of winter, a number of traditions have um, festivals of light. Um, around the solstice, we certainly need more light. And here in West Seattle, a true celebration of the holiday season is the tree lighting here in the junction. While we aren't gathering um, together in person to celebrate, I'm glad we're able to celebrate virtually like this tonight, um, appropriately for the pandemic, but also remembering that we are a community. We are one of those um, traditions and communities that has a history of gathering and celebrating light in the middle of darkness. Um, I'm pleased to be able to join you and celebrate and wish you all the best this holiday season and a very happy 2021. Good afternoon all, I just, uh I feel honored to speak. I'm glad that, that, that Laura asked me to speak and uh, just a couple of things that have been on my mind and on my heart. First and foremost, a lot of you know that I've been in business here for 47 years and I just thought I want to thank the West Seattle community, not only for me and my business, but all their loyalty to the West Seattle area, the businesses, the junction, and so forth. I've said it before and I'll say it again. I don't think there's any more loyal community people than the people that live here in West Seattle. And they bonded together even through these troubled times. 
that we have with the, the COVID and, and the economic situation. And most of all, I get asked all the time about the bridge situation. Let me just take a moment and give you a bit of history that has been on my heart. As I said earlier, I've been in business for 47 years. So I was here in business before the new bridge was built 35 years ago. I was here when the boat hit the lower bridge and West Seattle had no bridge at all. I panicked as a young businessman and a community person, but I forgot about the loyalty to all the people here in West Seattle. Our business, the morale, and everything of all the people was just so wonderful. And I've told so many people here since March 22nd that just be patient we're all here together, we're all in this together, and the loyalty will prevail of the people here in, in West Seattle. And talking to all the different businesses and people, that is certainly has proved true. So I'm, again, very, very, very thankful. I just thought I wanted to give you this little bit of history. Um, I feel honored again to talking a little bit about Christmas, that there's been nothing that my family has enjoyed more than the Christmas light display here in the junction with Santa and with my family. The countdown to see all those families out there that brought their kids and the booths and the people and everything was just, just wonderful. It's touched my heart and I think about it all the time. We are gonna do a virtual this year. And just another thing too, a lot of you know and have been very, very loyal to my family with my personal home and the and the Christmas display that I've been there. We're not going. We're not going dark this year. We're not going to do what we've done over the past 25 years with our display. But we will not go dark. We will have a wonderful display, and I just hope and pray that you will come. You will visit. We're all in this in this together, and I just wanted to tell everybody that from the bottom of my heart. West Seattle means everything to me. Thank you. All right, we're gonna do the tree lighting countdown now. Are you ready? 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one.